known as the inventor of the geodesic dome. Buckminster Fuller said integrity is the essence of everything successful. Bucky dedicated his later years to speaking to the young world as he sought to discover what it would take to make the world work for 100% of humanity. Of the many predictions he made that came true, one is only recently rising above all others. Bucky predicted the existence of a C60 carbon molecule. In 1979, he shared his vision with a friend, Marshall Thurber, who Bucky referred to as an evolutionary event of our time. At the Berkland School of Business in Vermont, while with Bucky, Marshall made a model of the C60 molecule. Bucky stated, although it has not yet been discovered, this molecule has to exist. This is the smallest and strongest carbon molecule in existence, and it will be used in medicine. In 1985, just two years after Bucky's death, the C60 molecule was in fact discovered by three scientists who had received the Nobel Prize for their achievement. They called the new class of molecule Buckminster Fullerene. They nicknamed the C60 molecules Buckyballs in honor of Buckminster Fuller. In 1992, C60 was found in nature. In Shungite, a carbon-rich 250 gigaton, 600 million year old mineral deposit in Russia, where Shungite's healing properties were well documented. In the 1700s, Peter the Great soldiers used Shanghai to purify their drinking water. C60's significant medical benefits have now been discovered. C60 has reversed symptoms of ALS in rats, inhibited the replication of the HIV virus, and C60 has destroyed cancer cells. Now C60 is believed to be the most powerful antioxidant in existence and the most effective method known to extend life as free radical oxidation, one of the primary causes of aging. In 2012, researchers made an astounding discovery about C60's positive effect on lifespan. In a toxicity test to learn if a volume of C60 could kill laboratory rats, researchers instead found C60 significantly extended their lives. One control group was given water, a second group was given olive oil, and a third was given C60 in olive oil. After 38 months, the rats given water had died. After 58 months, the rats given olive oil had also died. Only the ones given C60 remained alive. In fact, they lived 90% longer than the others and lived tumor-free. When C60 molecules cluster, their effectiveness is limited. However, when C60 clusters are dissolved, they appear to be hundreds of times more bioactive. And when C60 molecules are dispersed, they appear to be thousands of times more bioactive. This is the genesis of C60 for a fuller life. This is a moment in history that can change everything.